Hey, we got Drew's Views here, back for a little Anna Monday, reacting to anime on Monday with revolutionary girl Utena. Today it is episode 28, Whispers in the Dark. Was that what it was called? We just finished episode 27 and revealed the next title, but I might have already forgotten it or got it wrong. What do you think, Eric? I think we're safe. Last time on... You know, we're doing another back-to-back -back episode record, so we won't see the comments we requested about <laughs> do people like the Nanami episodes or that particular yeah. one. What do we miss? What are we wrong? It was it was basically a... Well, pause the arc with Akio and the, the end of the world stuff with the duels. Slap Watch 2022 is, at a, is in shambles. No slaps, even in a Nanami based Slap episode. Slap socks are weighed down in 2022. It is. Yeah. You know, it, it, the series seemed to be front-loaded with the, the slaps at the beginning. I feel like we were building cool some off. sort of slap crescendo and then just nothing off a cliff. Yeah, well, we'll see. Uh, dual watch, I guess. I, I'm on it this time. I think we gotta have one this time, no? We can't go back to not having duels. And, you know, I know you, you'll you love to get your theme, your duel song back and uh -huh. sing along yeah. and dance along to that. Will you favor us this time if we do get it with a little spin around pirouette move that um, mickey was doing in nanami's and her friends were doing in nanami's imagination we'll have to see if it if inspiration strikes you know okay i was born to dance but these knees are getting old that's true is that rough on the knees that type of move i guess it would be rough on the on the toes more i would think i don't know anything who's to it. say <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, we do a, do a chair spin, something. What what do we think for real, though? Whispers. I was kind of taking that to mean, like, secrets, but maybe it's not necessarily an association. But I feel like it's... I mean, something covert must be going on here if you're talking about whispers in the dark, right? Yes, I would imagine, if we're going in order, this would be Jury's um, dual episode for this arc. I would think, yeah. Well, she's kind of secretive, so that could make sense. Yeah. I mean, she's not secretive. She's just kind of aloof. Well, yeah, maybe that's right. Well, she's definitely aloof, but with, with her whole backstory with her friend and stuff, she was keeping that a secret, right? That's yeah. true. That's true. Um, and not, yeah, not revealing a lot to her her peers, whatever. Yeah, I don't know. It, it, are also, I guess she's the only one who has, yeah, of the student council then. Well, if, if Nanami still counts, I don't know, but the only one that hasn't see, been in the car yet and all that. Uh huh. And who would be pulling the sword? Are they going to bring that friend back again for her? Or yeah. Some, there's no one else she's really close to, right? I guess, huh? Well, it was the friend the first two times, so. Yeah. And we learned that the sword, if you're going to get the, the sword pulled time. out yeah, by someone close to you. So, hmm. No, I think it was the first two apps were both about that. Okay. The Black Rose one was the actual duel with her friend dueling, but then she, that was the second episode that story came up and she had been introduced before that. I think in Jerry's first kind of... That's like, right, episode. that's right. The, the like tertiary acquaintances were dueling Utena with swords made of Juri and Miki in the other, in the Black the Rose arc. Black Rose arc. Okay. Yeah. And, you know, Suobaki was part of that. He was in the last one, of course, being an Anami up. But, yeah. Well, I think we should go ahead and get into it unless we get, unless you have something more to say here. Let's do the damn thing. I am anxious to see my girl. Let's get it. All there right. she is. Looks like her. Talking about whispers already, too. We're getting right into it. So she did. Anatomo. Bye, The rose crest on his helmet? This is someone created by Akio. Red versus blue. Tie. 
Slightly slower. Who the fuck is this? Is he like a, a someone who graduated coming back to check up on the old fencing team? Maybe it won't be. Maybe it'll be this character and not the. Uh, because it did seem like the, her friend was kind of like. At the end of the last one, kind of. Uh, いる。ジョン。いや。いどいじゃないか、ナナミ君。ドバカイ。長らく病気で中学していたが、やっと福岡を果たしたという。おめでとうございます。うん。ゲスイエス。君たちが不甲斐ないと。あなたも選ばれてい
<laughs> but I still think he's gonna be the duelist, right? I know she did. No, it's her. He's gonna be him. He just needed somebody who, like, she doesn't have the ring. She's gonna pull the sword out of him, it must be. Yeah, he just needed someone who was obsessed with him or loved him um, to pull the sword out of him. That's what's happening, okay. Yeah. But we have another Jury episode where Jury is not dueling Utena. She's still going to, I feel like she might. Uh, I mean, I would think. So. Sure, but like know. this is twice in a row, right? Yeah. Twi wait, twice in a row, what? But we've had a jury episode where jury has not oh been the yeah one because to duel because in the black rose arc none of the student council dueled for themselves remember that's right but mickey dueled but in have... this in this kind of arc with akio mickey and and what's his name sanji have both dueled so i i feel like she still will but maybe but maybe maybe she's over it with this since she's the only one saying she won't do it anymore or stuff like that. She's not. She's the only one not doing it. Alright. Eric Maybe Dance Watch 2022. Oh, that's not oh, happening. No, not. I guess you don't want to revolutionize the world like I thought, Eric. Disappointing. <laughs> I don't think I have the power to revolutionize the world. I don't think I have the power well, of Well, we'll never, we're never gonna know, I guess. <laughs> Who would even pull the sword out? I mean, it'd be Xander. Yeah, absolutely. Willow would be sitting there, like, uh, scowling like, like Jerry from around the corner. But show this she and everyone else, it seems. Shobu, I yat the minaket about Wakarima Sayo. So not told that soon, no chikaranga. Boku de a katena gamoshe. Well, he's the first to us to like acknowledge that, basically, right? Yeah. I mean, I still feel like she's gonna win as usual. You know what? I wonder. Or are they introducing him at a kind of a late hour to be like the last the guy who comes in? That is what I wonder. But I just can't see what's her name getting a victory here. Uh, Shiori, but... But it's not... It's not Shiori, it's this random dude, right? Yeah, but I mean, just like getting a victory in the sense of like her man win, you know, I don't know. <laughs> What was this mystery element? Yeah. And make the world androgynous. They said a lot of sex gender stuff in this song. Interesting. Well, hermaphroditism. Okay. Stay no twist. <laughs> yeah, was he fucking dead? Yeah, you're getting dumb, bitch. 
そんなひどいわだかそうよ毎日あなたの剣を磨いてあなたのことだけあれはね僕の剣じゃなかったんだ<笑>君の演技面白かったアドリブにしては上出来だ Oh, he's saying she was lying. She only knew a tail that's not. She's you know, Kimi. Look, Nerai Wananda, Anata, and Nani will come at you. Okay, so he's not going away. I wouldn't think so. So, I know we all love Jerry, right? It's your favorite character. Some of us more than others, yes. I like her too. I'm, all I'm thinking now is uh, like she's really hung up on Shiori, who 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 is actually the worst, despite what she told Jerry. Yeah. W what's up with? I know. I mean, I know it's the past and all that stuff, but like you got to get over this one, Jerry. Like find someone new. Theoretically. And like, so did whatever happened in this episode? Is that is that what's going to lead to Jerry dueling again somehow? I almost wonder. If they're purposely holding Juri out of the actual combat, like they're doing this thing where like she's not dueling because she doesn't want the power, and so therefore, like if there's gonna be a team up episode later or something, like if she's really going to Sailor Moon this shit, because she's like one of the best. She's better than Sayonji and Miki, right? Well, fencing wise, yeah. Right. I guess this guy, this new guy Ruka or whatever, is better than her. Is the best we've seen yet at that. I mean, Sanji was an abuse, the kendo or whatever, but. Well, yeah. So, also, what was interesting, he said, I don't. At the end, he said he didn't have a good enough bride. So, they are just considering, like, these people to be their brides now, even when it's not Auntie is the rose bride. So, he didn't say my rose bride. I guess it can only be one, but, like, the people that pull the swords now are brides as well. Right. Is that what it's saying? Sounds like it. He definitely did say that. And it seemed like he was just feeling it out, like scoping the situation out with Utena, right? Because like he was, he was saying stuff like, "Oh, you might beat me still. Like you have whatever." You know, he didn't really, he didn't really get upset like everyone else usually does. Yeah. They get beat. So it seemed like he's scoping it out, like to figure out what the moves are for next time. Yeah, I definitely think he'll be back. Yeah, who is maybe Jerry won't. Well, what's the Sailor Moon thing you're saying? Sorry, I got stuck on that because I don't know. The, I mean, I it's been over show. 20 years since I've actually seen that show. But, like, there were those, like, extra ones that weren't part of the original fighting force that show up. And they're, like, they're not with them. It's um, it's Saturn and Neptune. But anyway, like, they're, they're not part of the original, like, group of them. And they're not um, okay. they're not in most of the show to begin with. And then they start showing up, but they're still not a part of the team, you know? Okay. They, they show up to help them because, like, that's their job or whatever. I I don't even know if that's right. Again, it's been, two, like, two decades. But that's what I had in my head when I said that. It's like, yeah, it's not Jury's story, but why else would, like, they give her a whole episode and then have somebody else that we've never seen before fight the duel, right? Yeah. I guess because they, they must be setting something up here. Well, what else was relevant in this one? I mean, I, th we had the car again, of course. Akio did his usual stuff, but he didn't really talk in this one. I guess he doesn't really talk much when he's driving and, and ghost riding. He lets Toga do the talking or whatever. Yeah, that's Toga they time. To each yeah. other. That's Toga time. I, I did like how they... Because, like, in the, in the Mickey one, where, like, is this really happening? Like, with the car coming and hearing the noise... This time it made it seem like that could literally be like they could have just drove up behind the fountain. But either, either whatever happened or if it was magic or whatever, I kind of liked the fountain parting and then seeing the car. That was like a, a good shot, I thought. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. what else. I like the episode overall. I do kind of... I'm intrigued by the new character. I guess I was saying he's on the student council, but I guess he's not. But he was just able to come up there because he got the ring. Right. Maybe. Or was he just... Or is he on the council and has just been sick? Because he's been out sick or whatever for a year or something or whatever. It could be either of those, as far as I know, right? Was he really sick? That doesn't really seem that likely, right? That's... Like, he, like saying that... Was he training this whole time for this or something? 
Or was he just, like, put on ice by the system because, like, he didn't have the rose power and he was too powerful to be, you know, like, in the lists for the first couple jousts, you know? <laughs> yeah. So it's not even going to go to school then. That's the other thing. Does he even go here? You're right. No, the fangirls don't care. Let's see what the next one's called. If that gives us any clues. It is called... Well, As you were paler than the sky. Oh no! Uh, I believe, I believe that's blue, right? Azure is a type of, a color of blue. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Blue paler than the sky. Also, just got an answer from the thumbnail about my jury question. God damn oh, it! Oh, we're getting thumbnail spoiled again. All right. This isn't even the moving gif. It's just the picture. It's just the picture above the next episode. Well, uh, what are you gonna do? It, and Jerry is dueling in it, or it's just her face. Do you want me to tell you? I guess so. We'll be on the same. Yeah, she's in the car. Same playing field, yeah. Oh, she's in the car. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, so it seemed like that was... Well, well let's not get too much into it. Yeah, well, swing and a miss with, uh, with, with my thing. <laughs> no need to comment then. But, yeah, it seemed like she would still have to duel. But, but yeah, that we'll, we'll, I guess in the intro for the next one, next Anna Monday, look out for it. We'll be doing that episode with the Azure and... Um, We'll talk about how we think, what, how we think this goes down. Who's gonna be sword pulling for her, etc. Why is Jury fighting now? Yeah. How is she gonna deny the call and say she's not gonna do it, only to do it by the end of the episode? We'll find out. But do a comment. Let us know your thoughts on this one, and in general, we love to see it, love to read it. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. We got you know, a, f a full uh, 11 episode, 11 or 12 episodes left. My math this was not good. I think 12. No, this was 28. So 11 left. Yeah, we're, we're doing it here. But uh, until next time, why don't you whisper a secret to our viewers, Eric, and we'll be out of here. I'll, I'll listen. Wait. Do you want me to actually do the bit? Peace. Good